Hey, hello guys, welcome along to an Xbox 60 pickup. It's been a wee while. Um, 13 games I've got here to show you. Um, yeah, so let's just get to it. Eh? Right, okay, so, and these are from various places. I'll try and remember where they're from. Um, I'm kind of behind in my pickups, and I've got piles of Xbox games. And um, so I'll try and remember where I got them from. So, first of all, Smackdown vs. Raw 2009. I think this is from the, the cash generator. It's only like one net and nine or something. Complete. I'm not going to do They're all complete. Um, need the wrestling ones, obviously. And these are no cheap in the. If you go to game or. There's no game station new, but game. And still, they're quite expensive for some reason, eh? I mean, my kids love playing them, eh? My kids are right into the wrestling at the moment. Um, and the figures and all that kind of stuff. Right, welcome back. I've got a wee visitor here. She came up. My wee daughter, three year old, Kizzy. So sitting down there really good, so let's see how good she'll be before we get through the, these games. Are yeah, you going to be good? Yes, she says. She nods her head. I'm going to give you a DVD to you. Yep, you give me that top one then. So the second game here is Vampire Rain. Um, this was from um, Crashnet. It was only like, two and a nine maybe it was. It's not meant to be a very good game. Um, I thought it sounds like it should be good, even vampires and that, but... Vampire Rain. Next game here, which I, I used to have this, um, Ant 3. I had this way, way back when the Xbox kind of first came out. Completed the game. Um, the only achievements I ever got was gone for gold for all the different um, kind of mini games now. Um, really good snowboarding game, probably one of the best snowboarding games actually. Quite funky and, um, you know, a lot of humour in it. But still a good, good game, eh? We have got Wanted, Weapons of Fate. This was um, out of game. And we're still doing it kind of 2 for 10, 2 for 20 range, but I had a few good games in the, few, in the 2 to 10. 2 to 10? 2 for 10. And um, the second game I got was Uncharted 3. And then I picked up Wanted, Weapons of Fate. Um, I've been... Oh, this one is actually... Car boot sale, we've not been for a wee while. Dance in one day. So this is Just Dance 3, special edition. I don't know if I've, the codes are um, extra songs by Katy Perry. I've not actually put them in to see if I've still got them. Um, car boot sale, so this was £3 I think it was I got it from, from them. Which is quite decent because um, it's not that old a game and um, my kids kind of love playing the, these type of games. Eh? I've got another Kinect game, and I actually got this from eBay, which um, I was watching somebody on vid and I was, I was watching somebody's video and it kind of mm -hmm. prompted me to kind of go to an eBay and I was looking at N64 games actually, and um, and then I looked at Xbox games and I managed to get this one, I mean pens. I think there was um, one, 150 or £2 postage or something, so, but it's Michael Jackson. Hold on, we did this one. Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson one. Um, all complete. And you can sing with this as well. I mean, you can do the, the dancing, obviously, but <laughs> Michael, you can try and do the Michael Jackson kind of dancing. And um, But he says you can even sing if you've got a microphone, so be good for parties now, because everybody knows a Michael Jackson song. This for the same, same car boot sale. And it's from a, a lady who had five or six Xbox games and I had them all except for this one and um, she gave me it for two pound um, four discs this comes with I believe what I never noticed though till I was kind of walking away was there isn't actually a, a manual with it it's just the kind of service numbers there um, I know the, the discs are there and the discs are fine but but it's not an expensive expensive game so if I ever get to the end of the collection and that was the only one I needed the manual for. I would probably I'd go and buy another copy. Eh? But at this moment in time, I'm not, I'm not going to be not too bothered with it. We've got Conflict Denied Ops. Not played it. So I don't know. I don't know what it's what it's like as a first person shooter, obviously. But um, or complete. I think that was like two ninety nine. Use a two ninety nine cast generator. I mean, they're not, they're not expensive. The Saboteur. Now, I've been after this for a wee while. 
Um, because I've always fancied the, the gameplay of World War II, the kind of resistance it's in black and white and something that's in colour and, and all that kind of stuff. I, I picked up the the um, strategy guide for it not long ago as well. Um, actually, my father-in-law got this because he was buying 2 for 20 and then 2 for 10 and he got Uncharted 3. And then he got the other Uncharted and 2 for 20 but Uncharted 3 was 2 for 10. And you couldn't see that again, so I got that, I was in the 2 for 10, so he got it. This is the, the giveaway I'm giving that she want to have a wee shot with. Thank you. There, welcome. Sniper, Ghost Warrior. Um, looks a really good game. Whether it is, I know, I mean, if it involves sniping all the time, then that's going to get pretty boring pretty quickly, so... Uh, complete. I think my feeling all got that and all for me. You must have, you find a couple of games you must have either got for someone or you've got a car boot sale. The other ones were um, Black Ops, Call of Duty Black Ops, which I took. And a um, long story, my one was uh, laser burned. My son, I, the son took my copy and he kind of forever got that new. Um, and then I eventually I got his big, his big brother's version because he had laser burned it, but I had already. Um, I got his, my mum copy back, loaded it into my Xbox, my hard drive, and then used the burnt copy. Because if you load a game into your hard drive, all it does is it reads to see if you've got the disc there. So it must just read a wee bit of information. So it was able to read a wee bit of information, and then it would just load into the game I had on the hard drive. Um, but when he got me a real Black Ops, so I got rid of my Black Ops, the burnt version, and now I've got a real version here, so I can delete it from my hard drive and... I'm not taking up a bit of space, so but I've already got the black ops, that's why I'm not showing you in this. A game I've been playing lots, and it's the PDC World Championship Darts. Really good game. I got it for 2 and 9 for cash in the later. Didn't think it would be that great, but um, it really is a good game. I've been really enjoying it. I've um, done a lot of the achievements. Some of, the, some of the achievements were are really hard to start off with. I thought I'm never going to be able to beat these because it's, you get 15 points for beating everybody. Again, you know, beating Phil Taylor and beating whatever the, the dude's name is, can't mean the guy's name. Um, and then if you beat them, and you, all you do is just put them down to one set. Put a game down to one set, 3 or 1, but you have to do it in professional oh, no. setting, which takes away your, your, your kind of power. So all you've got is. Thanks, you're aiming circle, but then you, know, you have to kind of judge it how far to bring back and go forward. You know, man, it's a good, it's such and a really, really Dad. good game. Really, Dad. if you can bet it's cheap, it's really game good game. Really it's just Mario. Hey, hold on, I'll be finished. I know, I'll be finished the new and I'll just and I'll show you, right? Two games to go. We'll get through it. Um, two for ten at range I got ages ago. <laughs> so, and then me just showing you the new. So we've got Ghost Recon, Future Soldier, if I can say that right, which I can't, but you'd know what it is. Um, no, I played it well, I've had a wee shot of it. Really, really nice yeah, Ghost Recon graphics. If you've played the previous Ghost Recon games, you, you, you would know that the graphics are really, really nice. Um, so it's the same kind of style. Um, but like I said, I've only just played the start of it. But this is the game I thought was fantastic, and it's Max Payne 3. Um, it was only in for the two for ten rounds for a, sh a short time. Then I managed to get it when it was when it was in. Um, excellent, 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 excellent. Um, Try to think of the past. No, oh, that's just so short. I mean, the the Rockstar past. Thinking about no, but coming. But anyway, it's a fantastic game. Um, oh. It's just that the, the story, and and you know, because obviously the first a first mission in any game is a tutorial mission, but it seems to blend that into the story it's just so good that you just right from the start you're into the game type of thing. Eh? Oh, the graphics are spot on. The slow motion with the bullets, blood, and it's just fantastic. Um, well worth forty quid if you're buying that brand new. You know, I wouldn't have been disappointed. Um, that's how good it is. Alright, so we'll leave it there. 
if my daughter's making a noise here, opening up all my consoles and that. And um, 13 games, I don't know what it pits me, it pits me in over 300. I'll put the proper figure down below. And um, yeah, till next time. Thanks a lot, cheers.